Hi guys, welcome to the unboxing quick review of this Poly Partners microscope. It says it has a magnification of up to 2000x, comes with five different colors, two lights, one from top, one from underneath, exactly how it should be. Comes also with a phone adapter, so it has pretty much everything what we need. So I'm going to take it out of the box, show you what you get, and then we are trying to use it and show what we can really see with it. And so here's the box, there is not much description here. So let's open and see. So here's already something in the main box, nicely protected. Here's some detailed instructions. Manual comes in different languages, German here in the back and here in the front some English. I hope you can see that if it's focusing it's not so much so it could be really interesting for you maybe to see all the details. It's just about five pages or so it's not too much and so we are already on the last page. We have to cut it open. So here we have it. There's even something on top here, probably for the light. So here you have the main part. It's heavy, but not too heavy. And we have some optical parts here, cleaning towel, storage box for the optical parts, I guess, some more parts. And here we have a lot of accessories for some experiments as you can see could be really interesting to store everything what you have found so let's also see what we have here yeah we here we have many glass plates for all the probes you can see we have even some samples yeah really nice samples here house fly many many more yeah absolutely awesome so we can start right away so you don't have to go outside when it's rainy or so you can start right away here to look at these awesome things and so we have to plug in the power adapter and then the plug here in this microscope and so we have the light we have two different possibilities to adjust the light here we have this toggle here where we can select where the light is coming from we have the option to turn it off or have it from below only or from the top only or from the top and from below and here we have the focus adjustment so whenever you do something whenever you adjust something it's highly recommended to start in the lowest position with the microscope stage and to adjust the brightness of the microscope we can do that here and here we have these three different magnification the one which is active is always down here of course so here we have the 40x here i think that's a 4x and then we have the 10x it's usually recommended to start with low magnification and only if you want to see more than increase that and to really see something we have to remove this protection and then we add one of these magnifications here we have the 25x we have 2x we have the 10x so let's see with the 10x just add it here of course we have to remove this protection here and with this wheel we can adjust the color we have the blue here we have the green we have the yellow purple and neutral and blue i think here so i'm having here one of these pre-prepared slides so i put it here underneath and we have to align it here of course in the center make sure it's not moving so we secure it here with these clamps and now we can look into the eyepiece and adjust here the focus slowly lift up the stage till we have clear focus i've already done this and it is absolutely awesome i try to show you something here yeah so i'm a little bit closer here with the camera and now we can see more or less what you can also see in real life i test a little bit with a different light but of course the camera will always try to adjust it but it helps definitely when you're looking with your real eyes i try the different lights from top and below 
Yeah, the light definitely helps. Without the light, you can't see anything. We can see already quite some parts here from the camera, but I can tell you with your real eyes, it's much sharper. This can give you just some very basic impression what you can do. I, I would say the quality of the optics is really good. Of course, there's no zooming. You have to decide on the magnification. If it's not fitting, then you have to switch, but it's an easy job to do. I'm trying here even a little bit further away, but there's no way we can get to the same focus, same clarity as we have when we look in it with our own eyes. And the really cool stuff is that you can see the same thing even if you are wearing glasses because of the focus. We can adjust the focus here so we can make it exactly as clear if you are wearing glasses or not. So I move here a little bit away. So I would say it's not a bad thing. I still can't find the phone holder. That's maybe some small disadvantage. I don't know if it's just missing or if it's not uh, really included in this set on purpose. So if you really need a phone mount, then maybe better double check with the seller. But if you don't really need one, I think you can't get really wrong with this set here. I think it's a really good beginner's set. Comes even with these slides, different magnification. I would say the optical quality is really good at least what i have seen unfortunately again i couldn't show you exactly what you are seeing because it is in the real life much better than what i've been showing to you but i would say if you can get it for 150 dollars or even below then it's a decent thing and so if you're interested i'll put down the link to the amazon listing down into the description so you can check it out and or the drive from there if you like it. And I hope I've been able to help you a little bit with this video. If you have any questions or comments, just write to the comment section below. And I'm always happy to talk about these things. And if you like the video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. See you next time.